and having three conference matches that are obviously extremely important to the conference race uh, is tough. Uh, we start tonight against Indiana State, who's seven and seven. Uh, they have one of the best outside hitters in the conference. And then anytime they're in system, they run one of the fastest offense we've seen. Uh, so obviously getting them out of system will be a big part of what we want to do tonight. Uh, scrappy on defense, a good blocking team. So a lot that we uh, prepared for just yesterday uh, for Indiana State. And then heading on the road to Loyola and Valpo, who have both had great starts to the season, 10 and 4, uh, Loyola 15 and 2, um, Valpo, they both are 2 and 0 in the conference right now. And I think um, last year, if you remember, Valpo was a team that took us, uh, gave us all we could handle here. They uh, took us to five, and we felt very fortunate to get out of that match with a win. Uh, and it's one of those teams that didn't graduate a lot. Both teams are strong in blocking. They're first and second. Second in the conference right now in blocking. Valpo is that crazy um, keep every ball alive team. So we have a lot uh, to prepare for, but very little time because when I look at practice, basically Wednesday is the only day we're really going to be able to prepare uh, for both of those teams. Uh, Thursday, we, we're definitely going to have to keep it light because I know on the weekend we're going to have to earn every single point we get uh, with the type of defense that they play. So, um, But I'm looking forward to uh, continuing this conference race. It's going to be crazy. Uh, some of the results from the first week have shown that. So um, we have a lot of goals in the conference. So I need to be working on some of the things, getting more consistent and getting better uh, each time we step on the court.